In this video I'll be showing you how to install Overwatch 2 onto your Windows computer. So this is a free to play game which means that you can download and install it for free and the only thing that you will need to do is create a battle.net account which of course is also free. So the first thing that you need to do is just simply click on the link that's in the description below to go to the battle.net website. Once you're here you then need to click on download for Windows and once the download is finished we then need to run the setup file. You will now end up with a window that looks like this. So as you can see it says it's going to install it to my C drive which I'm actually happy for it to install there. You can change the installed location by clicking on the change text if you don't want it to be installed on your C drive. You can also choose if you want it to launch with your Windows computer. I don't actually want it to. Once you're happy with the options you selected press continue. It will now begin to install Battle.net to your Windows computer. So once that's finished installing you will then end up with a login screen that looks like this. So you now need to create a Battle.net account. So you can either do this with Facebook, Google or Apple by clicking on the icons at the bottom. You can log in via that option or you can click on the create a free Battle.net account on this text here. So I've actually already got an account so I'm now going to sign into my account. Once you've created one then you need to go ahead and just log in by typing in your email and then your password and then clicking on the login button. Alrighty so once battle.net app is open you now need to head on over to the shop by clicking on the shop text at the top. You will then end up on a page that looks like this and you will now see the overwatch icon down here. You need to select this if you can't see the overwatch icon then you can click on the search icon and then you can type in overwatch 2. You can then select Overwatch 2 from the list. You will then see a play for free button. You now need to select this. And you then need to click on play for free again. While this is loading I think this is a good time for me to say I will pop a link in the description below to a guide that we have done on fixing crashing issues with Overwatch 2. So if you do unfortunately have any problems with the game then check out that guide. You can now choose where you'd like to install Overwatch. So I'm happy for it to be installed on my C drive. You can then change your language and you can then choose if you want to have auto updates on. I would suggest that you do keep this ticked and you can then choose if you want to create a desktop shortcut. So I'm happy with all those options. If you are then go ahead and click on start install. Overwatch 2 will now begin to download and install. Once it has finished installing you will then simply be able to launch the game by clicking on the play button down here. You will need to load up battle.net every time to be able to launch Overwatch 2. And once you're on battle.net you can then select games and then click on overwatch 2 and then click on the play button. So that does now bring me to the end of this video. I hope this video helped you out and you enjoyed it. If you did like the video click the like button below and if you'd like to see another computer sluggish video then click on that subscribe button. If you do subscribe then I will see you in the next video.